people will be interested with that, you know, if there's any developments. Now, it's one of East Yorkshire's best-known landmarks, but the materials which make up Beverly Minster require constant attention. And as Jill Archbold reports, one man has just been given the task of preserving the building for generations to come. We have one of the main windows viewing the whole of Beverly, and on the panes you can see where people in, over history have um, decided to leave their mark. The plumber in 1878, and uh, some of the past vergers that were here till 1982. Simon Delaney is just starting to learn about some of Beverly Minster's hidden secrets. So we've got everything from um, original tree trunks, which they used to build the original Minster. The materials which make up this building, ancient stone, timber, glass and lead, have now become his responsibility. The sort of immensity of it was scary, but I live in Beverly, I have done for a while, and it's the biggest, most prominent building in the East Riding. I couldn't say no. This working tread wheel is the oldest in the country. Preservation of such medieval features started nearly 800 years ago. The responsibility falls not with the church, but with an ancient charity called the Old Fund. Most clergy would tell you that they didn't get ordained to become the curator of an ancient building, but uh, in the Church of England especially, that's what we've got. Uh, and ask anybody about their local church and they'll tell you how much they love it, even if they don't think they're part of the worshipping community. So looking after a building like this is part of our ministry and our mission. Hundreds of years ago, when the Minster was first being built, the only way to get materials up to the roof was to lift them using a tread wheel. Modern methods may make fixing roofs easier, but the challenge of the 21st century is finding the money to do it. More than £5 million is needed to replace the Minster's high roofs. For nearly three decades, one man has been doing his best to patch them up. Some of this lead, exactly where I'm stood in here, is over 200 years old. It's a, a full-time job keeping on top of the leaks on the roof. Uh, obviously, if we get a really heavy rainfall, we, we'll go around and inspect on the inside and monitor the leaks. Beverly's Minster may be high maintenance, but those who call it their place of work say they're proud to help preserve it for the future. Jill Archbold, BBC Lucknow.